to Mecca. Saved us. One day, the Prophet, peace and blessing be upon him, looked at us and said, I dreamed that I entered the Kaaba with its key in my hand. We shall journey to Mecca for the pilgrimage and worship at the Holy Kaaba. He's coming here? Without weapons? He knows we can't crush a peaceful pilgrimage. All of Arabia would rise up against us. Blast him! Blast Muhammad! There is nothing we can do. Let them in. What? Bear the shame of letting Muhammad worship in Mecca? It's over. I'm sending Suhail. I'll let him promise the world. But the Muslims will not enter Mecca. We suggest a compromise. A peace treaty. We promise not to attack any of your people, and you promise the same for ten years. We will be allowed to enter Mecca. Worship at the Kaaba? Oh, most definitely. <laughs> Starting next year. You came back without even entering Mecca? But we will next year, and every year after that. For ten years. For three days at a time. Oh, to have ten years of peace. Ten years. Yes. The message of Islam can travel far in ten years. to become a Muslim. I thought you were coming to kill him. You meant to defend him? How can we deny it any longer? He is God's prophet. I bear witness that there is no God but God, and you are his messenger. And I bear witness that there is no God but Allah. And you, Muhammad, are his messenger. كل آمن بالله وملائكته وكتبه ورسله لا نفرق بين أحد من Muslims have been killed. They have broken the treaty. The Prophet, peace and blessing be upon him, decided. It is time to return to Mecca. Yes, Messenger of God. Messenger of God. On to Mecca! Now 
how they are the army of 10,000, with our greatest leaders at their head. I've come to speak with Muhammad. Show your hands. Now! It would be foolish of me to try and hurt him now. That never stopped you before. I come in peace! You can't blame these men. Naturally, they are concerned. Yes. Forgive us. We have been cruel and unjust. We have stolen, tortured, killed. We will not, cannot resist you any longer. The Prophet, peace and blessing be upon him, said. There will be no executions, no purges. Mecca will be healed by the spirit of Islam. I'm certain it will, and I too must witness that there is no God but God, and that you, Muhammad, are his prophet. I'll prepare the city. I am glad that despite my best efforts, I can say Muhammad lives. From rulers to the simple robes of Islam. May it always be so. I'll never forget the feeling of that day. It was filled with indescribable joy. A few years later, in Medina, after a short illness, the Prophet, peace and blessing be upon him, died. He was 63. He always lived a simple and humble life, giving everything he had to the poor. I wish I had met the Prophet. I wish I had heard him speak. Yes, but the words of God live on. Where will you go now? I... I don't know. I know. Maybe you can stay here and work in Mecca. What kind of work can you do? Oh, it's 
It's beautiful. I used to have a loom like yours, but I lost it. I lost everything. <gasps> if he had some wool, he could use our loom, don't you think? Yes. Yes, he could. Sir, you can have Bash's wool. No, it, it belongs to you. No, it belongs to you now. Take them to the market together. <laughs>